All right, you guys, hello and welcome back to my channel. Once upon a time, I dyed my hair pink using this one. Using this L'Oreal Colorista semi-permanent color in this soft pink shade. Since two years passed, I was wondering what's the difference in between this L'Oreal Colorista in soft pink and the pink color. Obviously, they look a little bit different. They look the soft pink shade is a little bit lighter than the pink shade but in fact when I dyed my hair initially I think two years ago this one the soft pink shade turned to be so bright and it was so vivid it's like not nothing similar to this one but of course it washes out and it will be fading after washes and washes but today I decided to give it a try and find out together with you guys what's the difference in between these two coloristas and pink and soft pink I expect the soft pink to be lighter than the pink color because it is lighter than the pink color I'm wearing this super old t-shirt because I don't want anything uh, any color to stain on my t-shirt so be sure to wear something uh, old and something with the and something not pretty and also excuse my dirty greasy hair because I did not wash it and real quick what I'm gonna be doing I'm gonna be mixing those colors separately in the separate bowls and uh, I'm gonna be applying the soft pink on my left head and the uh, pink on my right head and then uh, after maybe six or seven minutes because it says that you have to stay with this for 30 minutes so after seven minutes I'll rinse it out I'll wash my hair and then I'll show you guys the result if you guys did it then you know that it does not require any developer it washes out after five washes completely so you have no color left on your hair since I don't want it to be too bright like a flame going all around then I'm gonna be mixing these two shades uh, both separately of course with the conditioner then I'm gonna be applying a bleached and air touch so you can tell this is my natural hair color so this color doesn't do anything to your natural hair color even this color it will not do anything so that's why I'm not gonna be using it too much on my roots because I already have experience with the previous one it did not do anything I was just applying it really carefully uh, it just wasting my time so I'm gonna be using it right here everywhere on the on the ends and where I have a bleached color Okay, I'm gonna go mix everything well and we'll be back. Okay, that's what I got in this box. I'll also show you the close up, guys. But I'm gonna be applying this one on my hair. Okay, I started and I hope I'm not gonna be that bright as I was before the first time. And since today I don't want the color to be that bright, so I'm gonna be working really fast and really quick. And I'm gonna be applying it not separating and not splitting because from my experience it does not really uh, matter if you separate or you just dye it like that it's even better if it's like an ombre or maybe like highlights it's even more beautiful more natural you know that's why I'm not gonna be careful today because I don't want to be that bright and yeah, and careful, it's just not my thing, <laughs> you know, I'm just going to be doing this like that. Whatever I'm applying right now is a soft pink, and you can tell it's pretty soft, pretty pink. Right here, okay, it looks like this. And now let's apply Alright you guys, now I'm going to be waiting for 6 minutes and then go and rinse it out. So far I see that this one is pinkish and this one is more of a, on a purplish kind of side. This one when I was mixing it, it was a little bit brighter than the soft pink, obviously. 
I applied this one first and I applied this one second. Hopefully it will be not too bright. Okay, I'm back and I'm ready to see. So far it's not that bright, I really like it because when I was washing it, I thought it will be pretty bright. So now I'm gonna blow dry my hair and we'll see the difference, if there is any. But this one, as a reminder, I applied soft pink. And for my right part, I applied pink, this color. And uh, this is the final result. Turned out perfect for me because I didn't want it to be full coverage and it's too bright. I want to have some kind of highlights in there and that's why I applied it roughly. If you want the full coverage then you will have to apply section by section by dividing your hair into two parts. I will link a video how I did it in the past but the result was different and I like honestly for myself I like this one better because it's not the full coverage as I already said and it's lighter. It looks like it looks better it just looks not like you, your flame or you like crazy color and I mixed it in equal parts and for this one I kept it for one minute longer than this one because I applied it earlier than this one and I'm pretty sure when you apply it without mixing it with a conditioner it will be brighter it will be like this color I feel that this pink one is more of an on a purplish side I honestly did not see any difference but let me know in the comments below if you see any difference. For me, they both look the same except, yeah, now I see, I, I think I can tell that here I have less color and here is more color. So the coverage of pink is better than the coverage of soft pink. Personal opinion, maybe I will go for this one for the pink one because it covers a little bit more for me and I think I can play with the um, amount of a product because it's brighter. So when it's brighter, you can play with the amount of a product and just like desaturate it or uh, to achieve the desired shade. The shade difference, there is no difference for me. I, I think so. <laughs> so I'm gonna turn and uh, show you from from how it looks from the back i hope you can see so this one is soft pink this one's pink soft pink yeah you can see more on the soft pink side you can see more highlights so which means that it covers less hair than the pink one Okay, I hope you like this video and don't forget to subscribe and uh, check out my Instagram for if you're curious what I'm doing there. I love you guys so much. I'll see you in my next videos. Bye.